Long-time patients at CHEO often find the transition from a children's hospital to adult care very stressful. CHEO helps make that change easier with a mental health initiative that looks after both the hearts and minds. From the moment she was born, Chio has been an essential part of Heather McMurdo's life. I was born with a heart issue. At just 10 days old, McMurdo had her first of six open heart surgeries, five of them at Chio. My hardest goodbye is going to be to my cardiologist. She's been with me since day one, Dr. Lee. I love her. Um, saying goodbye to Dr. Maharaj is also going to be hard, like just all the doctors. Like Soon the 17-year-old will be graduating to the University of Ottawa Heart Institute. I'm nervous and excited. Like I don't want to say goodbye. Helping with the transition is CHEO's Youth Coping Skills Group, dedicated to those ages 13 to 18 dealing with a cardiovascular issue. So we'll start as usual, okay? I'm Counselor Inga Bonnenkamp leads a small group virtually. The goal to develop coping skills that address the anxiety and stress surrounding self-care, living with a chronic condition, and transitioning into adult care. Uh, bringing the youth together in a group, um, is I think the first step to you know make them feel that they're an experience that they're not alone. Mm -hmm. Big breath in, all the way down into the belly. Teaching techniques and strategies like meditation and breathing exercises, each person also given the chance to virtually connect and share their experiences in a safe environment. Sometimes when you're with your close friend, like they know your story and they know like what you've said, but they really don't understand what it's like to have to go through surgeries. We're experts at treating their hearts, um, their heart disease, but we have to remember that it's more than just the heart, that we're overall interested in overall wellness for our kids. The support group was born of an initiative and need identified by the cardiology team at CHEO. A lot of our patients come to the cardiology clinic visit um, feeling very stressed and tense about what's about to happen. Any way that can help those um, children and youth cope a little bit better um, with their cardiology clinic appointments is in, in everyone's best interest. Chio says a program like this would not be possible without the help from donors. Okay, I brought the smiley ball. You guys know him by now. <laughs> McMurdo recently wrapped up a six-week session, adding though it took some time to get comfortable, she's grateful for the program. Knowing that there's like people with similar issues in like cardiology really wanting to reach out and help us and like Thinking about us during these difficult times has been really nice. Jackie Perez, CTV News. Your continued support makes a difference in the lives of the children at CHEO. Please visit CHEOFoundation.com and donate today.